Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and the Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today, everyone, I'm here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Tauruses who are watching. So if you have Taurus as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Taurus, your person is whoever is currently undermined right now. You two may be in separation and communication at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and begin with your reading, Taurus, please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for your sign, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. Alright, Taurus, with that being said, let's go ahead and get into your reading. Also, please keep in mind that any energy, feelings, emotions, actions that I do describe from your person, that could be how you feel the roles could be reversed here. Just however this reading resonates for you, please only take what resonates out of this reading, Taurus. Alright, but let's go ahead and begin, starting with some specific channel messages for you all. Can we please receive a few messages from my Tauruses, please, when it comes to love? Who's this person that Taurus is dealing with currently? All right. We have three messages so far. Let's see what else we need to know here from my Tauruses, please. How does this person truly feel towards Taurus, please? All right, Taurus, so let me just get my cards together. We're going to take this one right here. Let's go ahead and put those other two back. What else do we need to know for now, please, for my Tauruses? Let's receive one more message. All right, Taurus, so we do have our first few messages here. Let's go ahead and get started. We have any interaction with you is the highlight of my day. We also have, I see right through you. Your carelessness will cost you if you're not careful with me. I could think about you all day. You are, you are heaven sent. I treasure you. And we also have, you've shown me so much love. I want to give you so much more in return. All right, Taurus, so this could be someone new that is coming towards you or someone that you're dealing with currently, but I feel like for you, Taurus, you can see yourself falling for them as far as maybe knowing how you feel currently and in the moment and thinking about how those feelings can expand and transform over time. So it's like someone does have your interest here, but I feel like for you, Taurus, you still feel the need to guard your emotions and guard your heart. And it's because of this person's tendencies maybe they're inconsistent or maybe they have told you something about themselves that you need to see the bigger picture like you need to find out more about this person before you can fully trust and fall for them and it's like you're also paying attention to this person's habits their actions and their patterns because stuff that comes out prematurely or in the beginning it can definitely travel and foreshadow what is yet to come just going to move my camera up a bit so yeah Taurus it's like you're guarding your heart you're not falling in too quickly for this person you're catching yourself before you fall and if this person Taurus if they have sent sent you mixed signals or mixed emotions or just have been inconsistent here that's something that you're not going to welcome in for your long term we have your carelessness will cost you if you're not careful with me I feel like this is your energy Taurus it's like you've been there, you've done that. You're not about to put yourself in the same situations that you, you've been in in the past. And you know how, how far your, your love runs and how it's nurturing, how you can take care of someone, how when you love a person, it, it comes straight from the heart. It's natural. So that's just not something to waste on just anyone, Taurus. So I feel like this is your energy towards this person as far as them not applying pressure 
maybe getting your attention in the beginning, but they've been slacking off here. We have I see right through you, your energy Taurus. It's like you're paying attention to any slip ups that happen, any red flags. Um, for some of my Tauruses, of course, this will not resonate for everyone, but maybe this person got caught in a lie or they said something in one situation, but then they referred back to that same situation and said something different. So you're paying attention to who this person really is um, before you welcome them in fully for who they are and accept their energy. It's just ruling a person out, still observing them, getting to know them, but you're not about to just be swept off of your feet by this person when no substance has really been added just yet. We also have any interaction with you is the highlight of my day. I do feel like this is your energy, Taurus. I feel like when things are running smoothly with this person, you enjoy it. You have no, no complaints. And like I said, you could perhaps envision them in your long term or dream or even dream about them, Taurus, but think about them long term. But you can't get caught up in that because it has yet to happen with this person. But I feel like this person does make you happy, Taurus. All right, next we have, I could think about you all day. I do feel like this is your energy as well, Taurus. And this may stop you from initiating things with them because you, you want to make sure that they're capable of maintaining you or handling this connection here. And sometimes when we have that feeling that we should lay off or something may not be the best for us, we do stop ourselves. And instead, we just are in that seven of cups energy where we're fantasizing or daydreaming, reminiscing, but we're not making any actions physically. And that could actually end up saving us or helping us out in the long term if we are on the on the cusp of something or we're not sure what we should do or we know what we want to do, but we don't know if it's the best thing for us just yet. So I feel like that's your energy, Taurus. Then we have some of your person's energy coming through here. We do have, you've shown me so much love. I want to give you so much more in return. So I feel like this is this person's energy, Taurus. You and this person may have been in separation or there's a lack of communication here. Or you, Taurus, you're no longer reaching out to this person. But I feel like from the beginning, from the jump, Taurus, this person has known how or where you've, where you've stood as far as what you want with them. You've always been solid. You've always been reliable here. Um, and I, I feel like you do what you can for people within your, your limits and your boundaries. And if you, Taurus, you do have a big heart, maybe you can resonate with you doing things for people when they didn't even deserve it, but you knew that it would make the situation better and it was nothing for you to do it. But I do feel like you have had to limit that. You've had to cut down on those sort of actions because not everyone is either rooting for you in the, in the same way you're rooting for them or it just has your best interests at heart. So I feel like this is this person's energy, Taurus, wanting to make a change here, make a difference, and really show you how much they do appreciate you. And we also have, you are heaven sent, I treasure you. I feel like this is this person's energy, Taurus. Um, you're different from other people that they've met. And I feel like they can tell or they just know it just by how you present yourself how you treat yourself, how you treat others. Um, you're the same type of person, like you don't switch up towards you're honest. And I know people don't like honest all the time, but with you being honest, you're not faking who you're not. You're your authentic self, no matter if you like it or if you don't. And also going into people understanding you, like not everyone is going to understand you towards because not everyone will will absorb that like privilege, you know, and not everyone is meant to get you get you Taurus. But within that, I feel like you do not switch up. And I'm going to say it's like what you see is what you get, but not even just that Taurus, like you're not faking who you are. And yet there's still so much more within you that people have to work 
in order to find out about about you as a whole but let's go ahead and get into the last few messages Taurus. what else do we need to know please for my Tauruses? when it comes to this person and this energy please let's receive two more messages all right i'm gonna go ahead and read this as an extra message it says i was a coward for hurting you i know i'll never regain your trust so Perhaps Tori someone really lucked out here or they missed out, but they did it to themselves here. And in the moment, they didn't know the consequences or they didn't think that you would cut them off or that you would separate yourself. But like I said, Taurus, you have your, your, sta your standards, your boundaries. All right, one more message, please, for Taurus. What else do we need to know here? All right, so we have our last few messages we have i'm only accepting maturity nothing less all right we also have weight i know how my love feels once i'm invested i need to make sure you're ready and lastly we have i will prove to you through time how much i care about you all right Tori. so I know how my love feels once I'm invested. I need to make sure you're ready. Your energy, Taurus, you know where you're coming from. You know what you're able, willing, and ready to give towards another person. So it's like you'll show your interest towards someone, but you, you need to establish and evaluate where this person is coming from, where their motives are or what their motives are, what their intentions are. And even if it's established through words, you need it through time, through consistency, through their actions here. And this may have been something that you've had to learn over time and really assert over time, Taurus. With that, we also have, I'm only accepting maturity, nothing less. I feel like this is your energy, Taurus, what you're welcoming, what you're accepting into your life, only maturity, um, be straight up, be straightforward. And anything other than that, it may be a complete, like, turn off. Like, I don't even want to entertain this. Because it, it's not of my value. It's not of my caliber. We have weight. I feel like this is an overall message. I feel like this is what you've been doing with this connection, Taurus. You haven't been doing anything more than you have. Because you've shown this person what you want with them. Or you've shown them what you want with them and what you're not going to accept. So wait it out, Taurus. Of course, don't hold yourself up from what else is out there for yourself. But we do have, I will prove through you, or not through you, <laughs> I will prove to you through time how much I care about you. I feel like this is this person's energy, Taurus. Perhaps I do want to make up with you, show you differently, show you better. But it's also not going to be a waiting game for you, Taurus. I feel like you're you're not going to lean on the what if with this person. All right, let's go ahead and shuffle for a longer descriptive message, Taurus. I'm going to shuffle three times all together, then we'll pull from the top. Let's see what else we need to know, please, for my Tauruses and their connection. And we'll pull from the top. And it says... You're constantly on my mind. I'm no longer blocking these thoughts. I know it means something. It just, it's just taken me a while to realize it. So this person's energy, Taurus. But something about this person's energy that I feel like you've wanted them to do all along is just to be straight up, be straightforward, but express yourself. And some, sometimes people, they know exactly how they feel and it's not an issue to express it, but because of the, the anticipation that the other person feels, it's like a power thing. Like, I won't, I'll, I'll leave you guessing because I'm in control. I know how you feel already and I know you want this with me, but because I haven't expressed how I truly feel or what I want with you, that my options are still going to be on the table so maybe you feel like that person um took that into accountability and they were holding their feelings to themselves in order to keep you questioning what they want with you taurus but i feel like i'm only accepting maturity nothing less that's definitely your energy you weren't going for that you're not about to stress yourself 
more because of what another person started Taurus. So let's see what sign you may be dealing with. We have Libra, another sign please for Taurus. That is Taurus, could be dealing with another Taurus. We also have Aries, let's do one more sign for Taurus please. Pisces, so Taurus, Pisces, Aries, and Libra. But Taurus, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.